My guest today say love is worth paying for. Please meet Stephen. He says the next best thing to finding love is buying it. Stephen, what is going on? Jerry, well, I'm a single dad. Uh, I got out of a real bad relationship back yeah. in 2002. Yeah. And it, it, it was pretty bad. It hurt real bad. And I've not been in a relationship since then. Yeah. So, uh, you know, I've done the Facebook, MySpace thing. And uh, so I'm flipping through the phone book and look at the, uh, I'm going through the yellow pages and I see this escort agency. And, you know, I live with my, I live with my parents. You know, yeah. I log for a living. I stay on the road, but I make oh, pretty decent money. Yes. Yeah. And, uh, but even if there was girls around, I can't bring them home. So uh, I called this escort agency, and uh, they fixed me up with Jazzy. I met her. So uh, Jazzy, she's a, I mean, she's a real spitfire. She's something. Oh, yeah. I'll tell you. That's and, why they uh, call it Jazzy, yeah. Yeah. But, uh, you know, we've been going out about a year. I see yeah. her about once a week. And... Uh, you know, I leave her, when I get done, I leave her about, I leave her $100, laying yeah. on the dresser, yeah. and uh, we talk on the phone, I buy her stuff. You know, it's like having a girlfriend. Yeah. Except, you know, just not to come, she's not there every day. Yeah. But a couple of months ago, uh, she got a roommate, Cat. Oh. And Cat, she's, she's beautiful. Yeah. You know, and with her, it's, it's just not about the sex. Oh, because you care about her as well. I do, yeah. Oh, okay. I've developed feelings for her, and I care about her deeply. <gasps> But uh, so you would like to have a relationship with her where you don't pay her? I would, yes. Yeah. And I need to tell Jazzy because Jazzy's been kind of suspicious because I'm not going to spend as much she's time with her. She's a prostitute. <laughs> I mean, you, you just don't hire her for that. Week. Well, she's been good to me, you know, but Kat is something different. Yeah. She's something I've been missing. And I need to tell Jazzy, you know, what's going on. Well, Kat is the one you really like. That's yes. the one you got the teddy bear for? Yes, sir. You think she wants the teddy bear more than the 100 bucks? I hope she does. Mm. <laughs> That's what my heart wants. There you go. Here is Cat. Mm. Hey, Cat. Hey. I know we didn't meet under normal circumstances, and I know things, you know, were kind of different like that, but I've developed feelings for you, and I care about you a whole lot. And it's not just about the sex anymore. You're somebody I want to spend the rest of my life with, and I want you to get out of this line of work and I want you to give us a chance. And I've got this, even though we've never spent the night together, I want, this, I want you to snuggle up to this bear and feel like you'll be snuggling up to me. And I hope you'll take this. Yes, I will. I want to be a girlfriend. Very nice. So you mean you're done being a prostitute just with him, or you're done being a prostitute? I'm done forever. Oh, you're, oh, good to know. Good to know. That's what I want. Like. I really want to be with you. I mean, you made me feel better about myself, and, um, I mean, I, it's not about the money anymore, and I've found somebody that actually cares about me. You had feelings for him all mm -hmm. along? Yeah. Have you told her about? No, I haven't. You know, that you really... She kind of suspects it, but she don't know. Okay. Does she know that you've been out with him at all? Well, yeah, because no. she set you guys up, didn't she? No. No. Oh. We met So through. she has no idea that you two have even been together. No. When I went to say Jazzy, she wasn't home, and me, as after Oh, I misunderstood in, that part of the story. And me and yeah. Kat got to talking. Oh, oh, so this is going to be news for her, because it also means you're going to have to be faithful now. Yes. Because if you're her boyfriend, you can't be going to prostitutes. No. You're ready to give that up? Absolutely. Well, you save 100 bucks a week. There you go. <laughs> Well, she knows all this now because she's watching backstage. Here's Jazzy. I'm so touched. I'm so touched at what you got to say to him. And he's my number one client. You know what rules we go through. I told you everything about him. You done seen him at the house, and you got nerve to come over there with you. He's just and you go get prostitute you always go be a prostitute you have always been a prostitute at what time did you cross the line and make the rules where it don't happen this my jiffy my number one client and you gonna take him from me is you serious that won't happen today not what is that Hey there, how long you think you gonna pay her? 
Jazzy, I, huh? I'm not going to pay her. You ain't going to pay her? We're done. Since I'm done when? That's all you think worried. you going to let Jazzy go? Jazzy, I you didn't want to hurt you. your mind. I didn't want to hurt you, Jazzy. I didn't want to. But she's got goals. There's other stuff she wants to do. What goals she got? She was in a bad spot. Or she wasn't even being in this line of work. She's a You ain't you love this. No, she's not. This ain't Julia Roberts. You ain't Richard Greer. How you know you ain't saving her? How you know I don't want to She's not a hoe. She's a hoe. How you know I don't want to You're a hoe. You're in this for life. How you know I don't Yeah, I'm 38. Uh, I look better than she ever was. Yeah. But ever. your uh, oh, your shirt's wet. Uh, <laughs> yeah. yeah. Okay, but you chose the line of work you want. Why can't she choose what she wants? She doesn't want to go She's into your profession. She's been in the business just as long as the next. She ain't gonna change. It ain't gonna happen. Well, if she wants to, she can she, try. Jerry, it. she's not gonna change. She's gonna be just who she is. A uh hoe. -oh. And when we get back home, you ain't gonna have nowhere to go. Where you gonna take her? The home with your parents? No, you I'm ain't gonna get my you gonna get I can you... afford to get a place and I'm no, gonna No, you do can't. It. Yes, I can. No, you can't. I, I can because I don't have to pay her money? anymore. Uh -huh. She don't oh, have to get paid for it. Let me tell you something. When You'll the money run paid, out, the honey gonna to. run out too. Well, if you're well, spending hundred dollars a week on her, it could be four hundred dollars a month. You probably could get a rent you could rent a place for that. He ain't going nowhere in his Jerry, with that. I was spending more money on Cat than I was on Jazzy anyway. Oh, so that'll really? be a lot more I'll save. Really? We'll be back. Yeah! If you think that was wild and crazy, then click here to keep watching. And don't forget to subscribe. All you have to do is click here. And one more thing. Take care of yourself and each other.